guys, welcome back to the Mary Boozers RC channel. Today we have the brand new Nexa P47. Papa put this together. If you want to see the build thread, it is available on hobbysquawk.com. Um, the airplane has come out of the box looking absolutely beautiful. Uh, it comes with all the rivet detail and scale pieces all over this airplane right out of the box. We have gone with an FMS. 1700 millimeter Corsair power system in this airplane with that prop. We're going to be flying it on a 5000 6S battery. Um, and I went off the CG in the book. Um, I believe it's 88 millimeters to 70 millimeters. You'll have to double check it in the book if you decide to get one, but I am running that CG. Um, super excited about flying this, guys. Uh, the build, from what Papa said, this plane is one of the most complete ARFs he's ever had. And uh, I'm excited to see it fly. Now, one thing I want to tell you guys, you guys that are have experienced the foamies, you've, you've got your experience all the way through, uh, the you, you, you've enjoyed the 1600, 1700 foamies, you've You've mastered your jets. There's only one way you can go, guys. If 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 both of you want to take your RC level to an, the next step, will be the balsa planes. If you're going to want to go to quarter scale and even maybe turbines, you're going to have to have a little bit more building experience. You cannot get any better than this plane, and then you would go up to the Black Horse bigger planes and you can't ask for anything better than that that's what i want you to get over so take a challenge get one of these balls of planes you won't regret it yep so without further ado guys let's get the nexa p47 out on the field all right guys you've been patiently waiting here is the nexa p47 maiden maiden flight That prop has got some pull to it. I wasn't ready for that. She's up. She's beautiful. She's nice. I want more aileron. Let's go. More aileron. All right. That's a quarter throttle right now. And it's feeling gorgeous. We and I'm up high, guys. I'm taking it easy. This is the maiden flight. It is a balsa plane. Wow. Is it locked in or locked in, though? Love those strikes. Wow. And this is about a quarter throttle right now, guys. We do have a 6S power system in it. I know they rated it for a four. Half throttle. And just gorgeous. All right, I'm going to come down from the stratosphere now. The only thing I didn't understand is why they didn't put a little more dihedral, dihedral in the wings, in the wing, but yeah. uh, right now it doesn't look, look like it needs it a whole lot. Wow, it flies great. With this prop set up, guys, it's not the fastest bird at the field, but it's got some pull. It's scale flying. This is scale. Wow, it is gorgeous. It sounds like a real prop the way it's yeah, beating it's, in the wind. It's, oh it's my gosh. Pretty, pretty precious so far. Wow. Once again, maiden flight. We're not going too crazy, guys, but she is gorgeous. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's. Top is cutting it now. I think we got the right system if we were going to fly scale and look scale. Going for a roll and up. Wow. I mean, I like it a lot. It's beautiful. It's a P47, guys. I've never flown a bad one. I'm going to go for the wing up on this pass. Not a knife edge, really, but just a photo pass. Oh, baby. Wow. Can't get any prettier than that. Wow. I love the scheme on this airplane. Me too. I like the Razorback. They do make the bubble top. You guys want a bubble top. Same plane, just a bubble top. Wow. I mean, I'm very impressed with it. Guys, I do believe we hit the hit mark the on the on the power, power system. system. Oh, oh baby. Oh, I hope that good. comes across oh. on the sound. Oh man. Oh man. 
And we used free wing servos, guys. You know, yeah. they have recommend high tech. Nobody says you have to use them. We use digital Metal Gear servos from the free wing planes, and man, they're they're beautiful servos. I don't know oh, why more guys don't use them. That fan is cutting some air, isn't it? And I mean, I'm at a half throttle, and it's just it's gorgeous here. I got the nervous shakies out, getting a little lower by the minute. And guys. <laughs> Oh, it's so, <laughs> it so we, cool, and the invasion stripes look great. We uh, we may anticipate getting a longer flight. We're going to only fly this for five minutes the first time. We'll it's a little nose heavy. I'd still like to push the battery back a little bit. Now, I knew it was going to be nose heavy. We got a big <gasps> prop. We got a big battery in the front. We got a big motor in the front. But it's it doesn't look real nose heavy. Oh, baby, the power. Power man, for oh, days. Man, oh, man. oh, listen to it. Guys. Oh, man. Oh, baby. It's gorgeous. Guys, if you want your first boss of plane, this is Papa's recommendation right Me here. Me too. A P47 is always a good choice. It's the right size, guys. You can put it in your car. If you like the 1700 foamy Warbirds, this is the same thing. And we're flying with Boston. no gyro. All right, now I am, I'm going to test the flaps. I'm going to be up a little higher and get a feel for them and turn it into the wind. Always do your maneuvers on your Maiden a little higher, guys. I know it's not the best for filming, but one notch of flaps. This is the Maiden. Second notch of flaps. No oh, change. Yeah, no change. No. Beautiful. Flaps coming up. Turning it in. Oh, baby. 10 second timer going off. All right. <laughs> Next pass, gear coming out, and then we're going to line her up for the landing. Man, it's always great to build something that flies this well or, or right. assemble something that flies this well. And Oh, there we go. Gear out. One notch of flaps, setting up our approach. I'm 10 miles up, but that's okay. I got 10 miles of runway. Second notch of flaps coming in at about a quarter throttle. Oh, Lord. Greasy. Oh, man. Come on, Dad. You did yeah. a good job on High that five one. On this <laughs> one guys. We hit, man. We hit it out of the park on this one. That is Plus, fantastic. Motion is giving you a hell of an airplane. Yep. I can't get over that more, guys. This thing is. They have worked out all the little details. I only had to get two. Look at that prop, guys. Yeah, that's crazy. The only thing extra that I didn't say in the build video is the only thing extra I had to have is two extension leads for the ailerons to get them into the, and I forgot yeah. to mention that. But, anyway. but uh, it's no big deal. Guys, Man, we'll oh see y'all back over at the bench for our final thoughts, and we can't wait to get it up again. Guys, maiden flight is in the books. The uh, P-47 did not disappoint. It flew just like I imagined it would. A P-47 is always a sweet flying airplane. Um, I this, truly believe this is should be your first balsa plane. Warbird. Warbird. It's the it's that 16, 1700 scale, just like you've been used to as far as your foamies. I think we. Got the power system right. We have the servos correct. I, I just, I just really believe it's, it's, it's correct all the way around. What do you think? What? I do too. You know, Motion has it on there as 4S for their setup, and you could easily go 4S on this plane and be fine. But I knew that we had so many 6S batteries now for our jets that I wanted to try with a 6S power system. So I had lots of batteries to fly. Not only that, but now this thing has unlimited vertical, which we'll show you in some later videos. Um, we wanted the scale prop. And we wanted the big scale four blade prop scale on it. Prop is, it's correct. 
Right. And so, it flies scale. Yes, it flies very scale and it sounds really neat. That prop out there whipping the wind is really whipping. <laughs> yeah, for all you hobby squawkers, here it is. Yep. If, so if you're riding the fence, it's hard to ask you, answer your questions. Yeah, and, and guys, like we said, if you are interested in knowing how the airplane actually goes together, check out down in the description. We'll link the hobby squawk thread for you guys. And uh I think I think I've said my piece for now on the maiden. Well, we'll keep flying it. Yep. See what happens? Keep flying it and keep you guys up to date. So, without further ado, we're going to let you guys go. Like and subscribe as always. Check out the Boozer Merge Store, and we'll see y'all later. And go to Cali Graphics. There's some graphic on the front of this airplane that you could get from Cali. That's right. There's a good example of what you can do with the Boozer nose art. And yeah, we'll see you next time. Right.